10 seconds. Fulmer boxing beautifully. That's the end of round five. Fulmer seems to wait until after uh, Carmen has thrown a combination, and as Carmen stays low, then Fulmer lashes out and usually scores one or two shots. Carmen fighting his usual style, pressing forward, carries the battle right to you, three minutes of the round, stalking, moving forward, always. Fulmer stays right outside of range most of the time. Real good photography, beautiful close-up. Gives a real flavor of this fight, a terrific fight. That's the bang-bang action you've been watching ever since the start. that crowd yelled. Fulmer, very accurate tonight. <laughs> A great round, and uh, the applause is merited. We got a thriller here going for the NBA Championship of the World. Those are eight ounce gloves, but most of the weight is up on the wrist. And actually, they boxers say there's less padding over the knuckles with these eight ounce gloves than the other style six ounce gloves. You can see a great deal of the weight and the padding is over the wrists. So while it sounds eight ounce doesn't sound much, they're pretty lethal, or as lethal as six ounces anyway. Generally, Fulmer has been moving away from the left hook. He's been moving clockwise.
He wants to be moving if the left does land, so he's moving away from it instead of into it. One minute. This is round seven of a 15 round bout for the NBA Championship of the World, Cow Palace, in delightfully cool 62 degree San Francisco. Ten seconds. Homer always seems to come out with that one last punch after each exchange. Just like that. He pinpoints those shots. Oh, he staggered Basilio. Basilio almost went down. Basilio's hurt. The round is almost over. The round is over. Basilio tried to trade with him and ran smack into a right and left to the head. Fulmer, who had been outboxing him all the way, caught him flush on the chin, and poor Carmen's legs doubled up under him, and he almost sat down facing our camera. Now, working on him now is Mario, uh, Mario Spaminato. Angelo Dundee is working very fast there he's the center man and al silvani poor carmen has been taking quite a punching around here tonight he has been stalking his man but his man has been moving away from his left hook he's willing to concede carmen a few rights but carmen hasn't been scoring very much with the right 
Now let's take a look at Fulmer over in his corner. He's got Marv Jensen in there and Angelo Curley and Billy Newman. Neither man is cut. It's been a rattling good fight, a lot of action, and let's see what comes now because we've got 15 rounds to go. And this is round eight. Excuse me, it's round nine. <laughs> 